Hello everyone, it looks like my new Amazon Echo is here. I am going to get this opened and I'll get a review up shortly after I can actually have a chance to a chance to test it. Um, of course, you know, we do not want to uh, I do not want to put incorrect information out there about it. Uh, as you can see, frustration free packaging, which is not as frustration free as normal. There we go. Packaged nice and elegantly, like all Amazon hardware products. There we go. Box seems empty. Here is the speaker itself. It's a very hefty little speaker. I can tell you that. You know, it's about as heavy as the other original Echo was. Um, I decided to go with this one because I already have a wireless hub. I've got a Wink system and. Uh, so I did not need the the new uh, Echo Plus that includes the wireless hub, and I liked the looks of this one better. And you know, hopefully the sound quality is a little better than the original. Um, it's a nice, uh, nice hefty speaker. I like the fabric case around it. That's a great plus. So let's see what else is in here. Of course, this speaker is not battery powered. It's like the original Echo. You do have to. Uh, uh, I have it plugged up all the time. Uh, it looks like it's got the same type of charger, which is kind of a shame. I was hoping they would go to maybe a USB charger. That way I could forego this big hefty power brick. But it looks like they did stick with the, uh, you know, just a classic cylinder style charger. And you've got your basic instruction booklet and your you know kind of a quick start guide uh, I knew this was delivered because I received an email the moment of deliver that says your new echo has arrived and is already activated on your account all you've got to do is plug it up and connect it to wireless one nice thing about these echoes is uh, Amazon actually has my wireless information saved in the cloud so more than likely all I'm gonna have to do is plug it in and it'll be ready to go so I will confirm if that is the case once I actually get it plugged up and start playing with it. So please be looking out for a review either today, tomorrow, or sometime this weekend. Uh, looks like there is a power button. Nope, that's an auxiliary out button right there. Let me get, see if I can get to focus. That's an auxiliary out button. So, you know, overall it's a, a nice looking little speaker. It's got the mic hose on the top. So, you know, it's, it's got the same design as the new Echo Dots. So, you know, it's physical buttons versus the twist top. I kind of like the twist top, but, you know, honestly, how often did I actually try to, uh, to turn up my Echo? One thing I didn't notice is no remote. The original Echo actually came at some point. I got my original one during the Prime, Prime member, uh, pre-order days so I got it for a hundred dollars and it actually came with a Bluetooth remote that you could operate it with and this one here does not come with a remote I guess it's probably a uh, uh, an add-on item that you can buy uh, it's got uh, of course Amazon Music Pandora Spotify uh, Hue you know it doesn't mention anything about Wink but that's what I use mine with is with Wink and you know it works very well with that uh, so I'm excited to get it plugged up and I'm gonna start doing that now and we will see you all later thank you